Welcome to Akshara Foundation's introductory video on multiplication. To teach multiplication, you can use counters, number line, and play money in Akshara's math kit. Take one group of two counters. Add one more group of two counters. Now we have two groups, with two in each group, and a total of four counters. We can keep adding groups of two every time. When we have 5 groups of 2, it gives us a total of 10. Students must notice that we are adding the same quantity each time. Multiplication is the process of repeated addition. The number line can also be used to explain multiplication. Let students try skip counting by 5s. For example, place a clip after every 5 beads. Count aloud. 1 times 5 is 5. 2 times 5 is 10. 3 times 5 is 15 and so on. This establishes the relationship between these three basic facts of multiplication. Number in each group, number of groups and the total. Now introduce students to the multiplication sign. This is written as 5 multiplied by 1, 5 multiplied by 2, and so on. Here's a fun fact. Ask students to notice a pattern in the digits on the right when we are counting in 5s. It is either a 0 or a 5. Children learn instinctively through handling play money. Give one 10 rupee note to Amina, two notes to John, three notes to Raju, Raju, for instance, has three notes of 10 rupees each. Thus, he has a total of 30 rupees. This can be shown as repeated addition or using the multiplication sign. Now let students notice a fun fact about multiplying with 10. For example, 4 multiplied by 10 is equal to 40. And 7 multiplied by 10 is equal to 70. Ask students what is 14 multiplied by 10. They just need to add 0 after 14. Similarly, 26 multiplied by 10 is 260. Here's a fun fact. One counter once is 1. Two counters once is 2. Three taken once is 3 and so on. The number 1 is a friendly number. When any number is multiplied by 1, the original number does not change. Multiplication facts can also be depicted by an area of a rectangle. For example, 5 times 3 is an array of 5 rows and 3 columns forming a rectangle. Now, let students find out 3 times 5. That is, 3 rows and 5 columns. In both cases, the product is 15. Arrived at differently, and in each case, the shape is a rectangle. Once students can visualize this concept, they will find that multiplication tables are nothing but larger and larger rectangles. Once they have seen the pattern, they can also work out the tables for 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Here's an important fact about multiplying by zero. For example, take three two times. When we remove one group of three, we only have one group of three left. When that is removed, how many groups of three do we have? Zero groups. So, three multiplied by zero is zero. The product of zero and any number is zero. Here's a quick look at the zero times table. Here's how we use multiplication in our daily lives. If one pencil costs three rupees, what is the cost of buying a pencil each for Geeta, Amina, Raju and John? Three multiplied by four gives us 12. The cost is 12 rupees. For a quick review, Ask students to solve the problems using the teaching aids found in Akshara's maths kit. With adequate practice, your students will now do multiplication with confidence.